hypertension in the meaning means high blood pressure let me quote again it is an intelligent physiological expression of our body to a perceived threat which can be physical chemical or emotional okay so there is a threat to the body okay here i'll have to elaborate a little bit i deviate slightly our body has got control the whole body is controlled by a nervous system the nervous system and the important component is known as autonomic nervous system or automatic nervous system without our knowledge it will take care adukku vande you have sympathetic and parasympathetic na rendu group irukku okay sympathetic is always emergency fight or flight parasympathetic rest and re- rest and restoration for example na day you are active you are sympathetically driven more night you are sleeping you are parasympathetically driven more okay so what happens anybody with high blood pressure the so called within quotes high blood pressure the do- go to the doctor say you have hypertension meaning you have a disease failing to understand it's not a disease it's just a symptom okay what is what you have to find out if this person has been having some either physical chemical or emotional injury because whether it's physical injury somebody punches you or a chemical injury you take a toxic food or an emotional injury some family death or financial loss the body perceives everything as the same and reacts accordingly so in an emergency what do you want you have to be alert okay mentally and physically alert so all the blood it has to be shunted to your brain eyes and extremities okay that's what happens so adukku vande the sympathetic over activity is there the contrary happens when you when you rest the parasympathetic activity takes over it shunts all the blood from the periphery into our intestine in for the digestive functions okay so a person with hypertension or diabetes or anything they are sympathetically driven they are in high stress body perceives as stress okay it has got to pump more blood to the extremities the heart has got to pump with a greater force to mobilize this blood all over the place after all what is the role of blood to transmit nutrients oxygen to maintain the ph to transmit hormones it got other host of other functions for that the body has got to pump with a great the heart has got to pump with the greatest force and that is expressed as high blood pressure so it is an intelligent expression physiological expression of the body to a perceived threat the threat stimulates a cascade of products in our body which is shown as the elevated blood pressure so you you say it's a disease and give a tablet what happens people with high blood pressure would always experience the pressure will come down after all the body is intelligent the body will take the pressure up again that is why you see people from no medicine to one medicine to multiple medicine going on and on okay until they get into major issues so any person who is treating for example i am going to treat a person with high blood pressure now i have to be like sherlock holmes try to look out what what are the problems he is having is it a physical chemical or emotional or certain deficiency for example vitamin d3 kami arda your pressure is going to be high so and mari we have to look into the you have to take the individual as it is get into all these things find out the cause correct the cause the pressure is going to come down this has happened practically i never thought i will do this for my hypertensive though initially i was confident of doing for my diabetics i was able to succeed but the collateral benefit was people had high blood pressure diabetes it became normal after all the cause is same the cause is maybe physical chemical or emotional injury the results are instead of one branch is got multiple branches as sudha had she had hypertension she had diabetes she had cholesterol there are multiple branches okay once you correct cut the root everything becomes normal so this is a collateral benefit i never thought it will happen but that's a learning curve for me i understood no this can be managed without any medicine so hypertension does not require any medicine it has been 
dubbed as a disease so that pharma industry can produce chemicals for that chemicals can be patented food cannot be patented so there is money huge money so when you knock off diabetes and hypertension without medicine the medical industry the pharma industry will simply collapse don't worry don't worry that not going to happen hypertension like here i would like to make uh, two two examples two major studies one is known as helsinki businessman study done in in finland and another one uk mrc trial in the uk in the uk mrc trial that they took 9000 patients two groups one was intensively treated for high blood pressure another one they given advice okay in the treated group 452 people died in the untreated group 448 people died a difference of four statistically insignificant whether you treat high blood pressure with medicine or without medicine the end point is the same that is heart attack stroke sudden that kidney issues are all the same so when i treat a person with high blood pressure conventionally give tablet the pressure comes down the numbers come down the doctor is happy the patient is happy but the end point there is no difference that is what that study proved helsinki businessman study is even worse they did the same thing with a group of high risk individuals high pressure high sugar high cholesterol everything was treated the other thing advice was given there is more mortality in the treated group so what's the underlying message drugs kill people because the complications of drugs the long run are more than the benefits this is proved this is not coming out thanks to the industry so hypertension does not require any medication it can be managed without medication after all when you change the diet what happens you lose weight once you lose weight bp comes down you go to any doctor any conventional doctor with high blood pressure one of the advice they give sir neenga 10% weight okoringa three abodu how only he will not be able to say i do not know the doctor does not say so hypertension does not require any medication 